Hi, I'm Chris from lasertv.co.uk and in this video we're going to show you how the laser TV system, that's the projector plus the screen, performs in ambient light conditions. So we've set up our studio lights to match the lumens, which is a measurement of light that you normally have in a living room. So this is what it would be like during the day with the curtains open. And as you can see, if you just project onto a white wall without the screen, that's the legend. The image is very washed out. The blacks aren't really black and the colors are hard to see. So what I'll do now is put the screen up and you can see the difference from using a screen in ambient light versus using a white painted wall. So as you can see, when you have the screen up, it's rejecting a lot of the ambient light and you can see the colours. The blacks and the darks do look dark and you can watch the image just like it was a normal TV. That's with the curtains open and with maybe even some lights on. Our studio lights here are quite bright. And I'll put it down halfway so you can see a comparison between the two. So I think it's really easy to see the positive impact using a proper ambient light rejecting short throw screen makes on the viewing experience. If you just have a white wall, it's hardly viewable at all. If you use a proper screen, you can view the, the, uh, the movie just like you would a normal TV. When does a white wall work? Well, that works when you have all the lights off. So I'll turn all the lights off now and you can see what it's like on the white wall. And just for comparison purposes, I'll put the screen up now as well so you can see just how much of an impact having the screen up in a dark room has on the on the quality. We'll rewind that again. And I should say, even though this is now a dark room, there's still some ambient light coming in. We've still got a light on over there and um, there's still light coming in here through some small windows so it's not a truly dark room yet by using the screen you can see that the blacks are extremely black and the colors are vivid and the white areas are white even though the screen is actually gray in color when you turn off the projector you're getting the full spectrum of colors there you're actually getting HDR, which is high dynamic range. So a lot of 4K content now has this HDR badge attached. That means that you're getting this really, really, really deep color to the footage that you're watching. And I think it's easy to see just why laser TV systems are uh, wowing people in demos. Hopefully that comes across in this video. If not, you're going to have to take my word for it. It really is stunning. And um, yeah, lasertv.co.uk.